Now, translating videos to different languages can help make the video accessible to many people. It can make it easy for people with hearing disability or non-native speakers to understand your videos. Additionally, by translating your videos, it can be useful for people to read in quiet environments like the hospital, for example, or in noisy environments like a bar. In this video, I'm going to show you how to automatically translate your videos online. Hi there, I'm Winston from TubeMechanicsNotes.com and in this video, we are going to be looking at the why, the how and some free tools you can use to automatically translate videos online. But before we get into all that, if this is your first time to this channel and you are interested in starting, growing and monetizing your videos on YouTube, make sure to hit that subscribe button and let's get started. With almost 60% of video views on YouTube coming from non-English users, imagine the boost you get from adding your video transcription in multiple languages. We have already talked about how translating your videos to different languages makes the video accessible to many people. And like I said, it makes it easy for people with hearing disability or non-native speakers to understand your video and how it can be useful for people to read in quiet environment as well as noisy environments. But the big question now is, how do you go about translating videos online? Well, a simple way of translating videos that is widely used by many people online is by simply uploading the video into a software, generating the subtitle automatically and finally translating the video into any language that you want. Now, assuming you want to create a video and you want to make it accessible to the global audience by automatically translating it online, here are the best video translators you might want to consider to help you get going. Capewing is an easy to use video editor for translating videos into many different languages. All you have to do with the Capewing video editor to translate your videos is to upload the video, generate the subtitle of the video in a variety of languages. Basically, this tool was designed to make content more accessible, engaging and compelling, which is why it's one of the best ways to add translated subtitles to your videos with no watermark. The tool uses AI machines to listen to the audios in your video and then automatically add translated subtitles. Here is how to get started with the Capewing video editor. Head over to the Capewing website and log in using your Google account. Then you want to click on the get started blue button and you'll be taken to the video editor. Next is uploading the video you want to translate by clicking on the upload button and navigate to wherever you save the video and upload it. After uploading your video, click on the subtitle option here at the top to add subtitles to your video. Now, there are three ways to add subtitles to your uploaded videos. You can either play the video, listen to what is said in the video and manually type it out here. The second way is by uploading an already typed out generated subtitle saved in an SRT file or simply auto-generate the subtitle by using this auto-generate button. When you click on the auto-generate button, you will be presented with another pop-up that will help you translate the video. You can either translate the video to its original language or translate it to another language by checking this box here. Now, if you click on the checkbox, which you should if you want to translate the video, you'll be presented with the option to select the language you want to translate the video to. There are more than 60 languages you can choose from when translating a video using the Keepwick Video Editor. What the video editor does is, it burns the translated subtitle into your video directly so that the subtitle will be available on any platform that the video is being shared to. You see, the Capewing Video Editor makes it easy to translate videos into languages that you probably don't know or you are still learning. You can also adjust the font, size, color and position of the translated subtitle using any of this feature here on the left. 
you can make the subtitles appear higher or lower on your video or even resize the video so that the subtitle fits exactly where you need it to be now when you are finished with your settings you can hit the done button below to finally export and save the translated video file the vid online video editor is another well-known app for translating videos automatically the vid tool is quite simple to understand it can help you translate your videos into many different languages now if you are a subscriber to this channel you must have come across my tiktok video series in which i showed you how to use the vid tool to convert your youtube channel videos to tiktok videos you'll find the link to that video series in the cards in this video or in the description box below now make sure to hit the like button below this video and keep watching if you would like to learn how to use the vid video editor to translate your videos online now because editing video is a difficult process especially for beginners the vid video editor comes with a live chat feature that you can use at any time if you need help in translating your videos the only problem now is that although this tool is completely free to use you will need to have a pro account to be able to translate your videos so how do you use the vid tool to automatically translate your videos online well what you want to do is go to vid.io i will drop the link to this site below this video now you want to sign in using your google account and when you do that click on the new project button this pop-up is going to appear when you click on the button with different options you can use to upload the video file you want to translate you can either upload the video file directly from your device drive or any of these cloud-based platforms now if it's a published video on youtube you can just copy and paste the link here and the v2 will pull up the video for you from youtube so you don't have to download the video before uploading it to the software so after the video is uploaded you'll see it displayed on the video timeline here below let me just play the first half of the video so you can listen to it text to speech softwares is the best option now i'll just cut the video off right here because the free version of the vid software is limited only to 10 minutes long videos now all you have to do next is click on the subtitle option here on the left side and this pop-up will appear with different options like manually typing in the transcript of the video you want to translate uploading an already generated subtitle using this option or simply go with the automated option just like we saw with the cabling video editor now click on the select language option here and select the original language of the video in this case as you heard the video before it's in english so i'll go with that the v2 will now transcribe the video first and after it does that you'll see it displayed on this pop-up you can now go ahead and correct any mistakes within the subtitle if any now before we start translating the video transcript let's first adjust the subtitle timeline below here to make sure that it matches the length of the video timeline to do that click and drag the end of the subtitle timeline to match the video timeline here below and you are good to go now to start translating the video subtitle simply click on the translate option next to the subtitle option here remember that this was the original language of the video now what you want to do next is choose the language that you want to translate the video to so click on the next button and select the language from the list of countries vit is offering for translation in this case i'll go with the german language since i reside in a german speaking country next is clicking on translate to translate to whatever language you choose to translate your video to now you know how to use two different tools to translate videos online you can join us in the youtube talk facebook group where we share and discuss such topics to help each other grow here on youtube and with all that i'll wrap up this video i hope it was helpful if so hit the like button below share on your preferred social site and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss another helpful video